For us at SAPI, this was not the first time we've used open innovation. We found it's a means of rapid research deployment. We get access to a wide community of providers and they inevitably have solutions to technical problems which we do not have to spend time on developing ourselves. Open innovation is an ideal approach to licensing technology for quick results. We decided to use open innovation because it's already delivered results for us. The challenge for us was the production of new or novel chemicals from the pulp or paper mill waste streams. It would be solving two problems with one solution, new revenue streams and reduced waste. We are already working on this in-house, but we wanted to widen our search for opportunities and recognise we do not necessarily have all the skills, and in particular when it comes to downstream products. Through the Open Innovation Solution Exchange platform, we were able to highlight three companies with a diverse array of opportunities. Two were interested in flavouring and fragrances, but from different waste streams, while another was interested in phenolic resins for the production of grinding discs. We've met with all three parties and proposed a way forward in each case. The benefits will be realised from making the connection with these companies operating completely outside of our industry. Chuani is the academic capital of the country, with more scientists per square kilometre than any other city. It's not possible to meet every solution provider or to discover who has what skills. And so the Open Innovation Platform is a perfect initiative to bring together seekers and providers. In a rapidly changing world, SAPI's pulp and paper industry is dependent on technology and in particular on innovation in technology to remain globally competitive. Open innovation is one means of rapidly deploying technology which will impact the profitability of our global operations.